death battle was proclaimed. And today, finally, we shall see the results of all the battles. <laughs> oh, okay, I guess I'm done now. Yeah, I knew they was around here somewhere. Hey, JT, I got the goods, boy. <laughs> yeah, now me, I'm some swagger for this death battle, here you go. Oh. You can wear it like a, like, like a sideways hat, you don't necessarily gotta wear it like the mask, but like, kind of like on the, like on the sides. Yeah. Yeah, like this? Yeah, something like that, something like that, like, you know, it's like, it's goofy, it's goofy, but you, you know, it, it, it can kind of work like that. It'll work. Yeah. And I found the old school foam finger. Now, Drake and Josh taught me the power of the foam finger, right? Okay. Like, I gave you the mask because you already got the Marvel hat on, so it, it's like, it, it works. You know, you gotta keep it on the whole time if you don't want to, but you know, it works. It fits your motif today. That's what, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna okay. wear this like this. Yeah. You know, we had to get the foam finger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we are. Finally. Finally. Death battle. It's been about a week or two since the last one. Yep. It was like February 23rd was the last one. February 23rd. Something like yeah. that. Two weeks. I think so. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. And we already have our predictions. See, we on the same page this season of Death Battle. Yeah. Like, we ain't... There hasn't been discrepancies yet. True. Like I think the the biggest maybe has been uh, Black Canary and Sindel, but I think we both were just like, I think yeah. Black Canary got it. Yeah, that logic at the end. Mm -hmm. It worked. Yep. Yeah. Now, last time we already knew Jason was gonna take that mess. Yeah, that was a gimme. Yeah, I was like, man, they, <laughs> it won't even close. <laughs> this time around though, we we gotta we we got something a little bit to prove now. Uh, people said well, we flat out wrong <laughs> about this. Oh, flat out wrong. Flat out wrong. Oh, okay. That we don't know what we talking about. That we, that we don't know. We don't know what this man has put in on uh, in them comics. So you know, I thought I don't even got no One Punch Man merch anyway. But you know, since people think that we flat out wrong, I I wanted to give him fair due. War Machine. No, Genos versus War Machine. I'm gonna put Genos first because you already know who I think is gonna win. <laughs> But I'm gonna put some respect on this man's name so, so that people understand that I'm just not pulling this out of nowhere. But they thought that I did I didn't rep this man at all. No, I got you. Right? Like, Alright. I got the merch, I got full on stuff back in, in like my little cosplay closet. I ain't never put together a war machine now. That, that's a little oh, bit too much. Yeah, that's a lot. I can't do right no here. Iron Man, so you know I can't do no war machine either. <laughs> but People say I need to put some respect on this man's name, so you know we got the merch out. And you already had a Marvel hat on with the X Men and everything, so I was like, all right, at least, at least you're on like the ways. And this ain't exactly the right color, but it's gonna look like the right color to them, cause you know, it's it's not exactly right, but it is what it is. So, death battle. Genos versus War Machine. I I think Genos got this, but. We'll, we'll see. I don't know. They, they could open up some uh, repertoire for if, War Machine. If War Machine wins, I'm not going to be upset. It's just, I don't yeah. know. When it, when it comes to comic BS and anime shenanigans, they kind of, they're oh, like man. almost on the same level. But I always think that anime shenanigans beats comic BS. But that's just because they have like the gag physics and whatnot in like the anime and whatnot. So it is what it is. But we're going to go ahead and get into it. Death battle. Going to cue it up. And then we going to get down to business. Let's do it. Rules to teeth. Iron Man. 
Why they have to call him an understudy? Like, like, I think he gonna lose the fight, but y'all ain't gotta sell him short like that, like, like that, like that, like that. Genos was a happy 15 year old living a quiet kind of. life until his family and town were obliterated by a deranged cyborg. Thankfully, he was saved by a scientist, and Genos had one request. He wanted to be a powerful cyborg, too. Weird. Sure. I mean, I yeah. guess he really liked how the other cyborg violently murdered people. No, this was a means for revenge. Genos set out on a walkabout of justice, though it wouldn't be long until he found his match in the one and only Mosquito Girl. This bug's making me pitch a tent, and uh, not to keep her out, if you know what I mean. You. Yeah. Luckily, another hero stepped in to save the day. Yep. Look mm. out! It's the One Punch Man himself. She had a lot of blood in her, man. She she, she splattered the building with blood. Like they repainted that building. It looked like someone went out and just graffiti, like a giant came in and just graffiti all of that building. That was crazy. <laughs> I mean, his hero name is Kate Baldy. Canonically. <laughs> That's the name that the Hero Association gives him, so not far off. Distant and fast. The Saitama was moving, moving. And it can shoot a blast of blinding light. Solar flare! But there's far more weaponry hmm. across his body. Hidden blades, arm missiles, and electric shocks, just to name a few. With his rocket boosters, he moves faster than almost anyone. And he can even fly. Well, sort of. You didn't even mention that his arms have freaking cannons in them. These are his incinerators, powerful blasters of fire of which yeah. can control the size of the resulting explosions. And slapping both arms together makes the more powerful spiral incinerator blast. Then there's his ultra helix incinerator. Huh, if only I had two shotgun legs, I could put both of them together for an ultra leg blast. Oh boy, uh, boom, sick. Oh, I mean, it's not that hard. All you do is first lift one leg like this and then you just lift the other one. That, what they were showing in the background, that's the one that makes me think he don't win this. Him fighting, um, that giant millipede thing. Yes. Exactly. Incredibly fast. Moving faster yeah. than the human eye can see. He targeted and struck this city destroying meteor rocketing through the sky. And those big boys are no joke. What big boys? Meteors. Those things killed the dinosaurs. Well, the fact that he was able to actually hit the big boy, not just target it, means he must have been moving 200 times faster than sound. Genos is badass enough that he can survive. Yeah, I mean, I mean, he didn't destroy it. Like, if Rhodey destroyed anything of that level, then he would immediately beat Genos. But that's measuring the size of that swarm, we deduced he's being crushed by 65 trillion mosquitoes, a combined weight of 358,000 tons. Please, God, let me go any way but that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that would actually disturb me. To be honest, I would have accepted death immediately. Immediately. Like, not upon impact, but when I saw it. <laughs> that's too many dang mosquitoes for me. <laughs> I was about to say, he's way stronger than when he fought the mosquito chick, though. Like, 
I don't even think it's like a relative scale anymore. <laughs> Because legit legitimately, that upgrade that he got when he fought Saitama was way better than when he fought the Mosquito Girl. Like, just bar none. <laughs> For some young boys like James Rhodes, joining the military seems the best way of making something of themselves. And Rhodey fit True. right in with his neck for machinery. I know a lot of brothers that have done it. marks in the Army and became a pilot. Eventually becoming an expert in aviation engineering and military combat. Then, on one fateful mission, his helicopter was shot down. Things didn't look good, but then Iron Man showed up. Turns out Rhodes wasn't the only one in trouble. Tony Stark was stranded yeah, without enough go. power for his suit and asked for his help. The two began an epic adventure. Had him out here looking like Black Rambo. <laughs> Rhodes stepped into the shoes of a superhero and became a man his younger self would be proud of. And being Tony's best bud had some perks, like taking over as Iron Man sometimes. Who wouldn't jump into that suit at the first chance? Next time, baby. And nope. eventually, Tony offered Rhodes a suit. <laughs> Won't know next time for you. Ooh, sad days. War machine. Oh, yeah, it's like Iron Man with more guns. Rhodes has spent years... Unnecessarily more guns, yes. As War Machine, he found a way to truly... That's always my caveat with War Machine, man. Like, he, it looks nice until you realize that Iron Man has lasers that are just better than any of the guns he has. <laughs> yeah. Suits throughout the years, each improving upon the one before it. Oh, uh, and these babies are a beautiful piece of work. Just look at all those weapons! The suit is a specialized variation of the typical Iron Man armor, focusing more on firepower than tactics and maneuverability. Clearly, True. Its alloy is composed of titanium and vibranium. Hey, like Captain America's shield! Which means it's both extremely durable and light enough to fly at incredible speeds. Yeah, Very important true. given the Life support system. You got vibrating in You know what? I'm gonna let it. It's comics. Yeah, I'm gonna let it. It's comics. That's fair. That's fair. I knew the titanium. Come on, man. 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 Come on, I swear we yeah, gonna get into some stupid stuff. I already know. It's comic BS yes, about to take the lead. <laughs> it uh, it was white when I bought it, but I accidentally washed it with my hat. So obviously I'm pretty hyped about the guns, but the armor has a lot of really cool other things too. His most up-to-date suit includes incredible chameleon systems that yep. allow him to not only become invisible, but, but phase through stuff, bypassing yeah. scanners and phasing through walls. You know I could really use that the uh, next time you try to stab me with a trident. It was one time, and in the most mm. dire of <laughs> circumstances, War Machine has a self-destruct function he can call upon to make sure his tech doesn't fall into the wrong hands. Why do they keep bringing up these self-destruct sequences? Like <laughs> Has he been thrown through a mountain with enough force to cause an earthquake? He survived getting nuked. You see the size of that crater? Compared to War Machine himself, this looks like the explosion was over two and a half megatons of TNT. And the suit is fast enough to fly into orbit and out into space. Take that, Elon Musk. No, but please send me one of your flamethrowers. Sorry, mm -hmm. not a flamethrower. I <laughs> see you. Given how it only takes War Machine about 10 sure. seconds to exit the planet's orbit, and measuring the distance he's traveled, this puts him at flying speeds over Mach 620. And while he may be speedy, Rhodey's also strong enough for his hits to be the first and last. He's lifted cars, thrown tanks, and tossed a dude so hard, he destroyed a spaceship. Not to mention the fact that Tony created the okay. War Machine suit to be mm. on par with his own Iron Man suit. No, now, no, <laughs> now, <laughs> look, 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 maybe at the time, maybe the first War Machine suit, but we, look, Rhodey ain't never getting armor that was on, like, superior Iron Man levels or even the newer ones that uh, Tony has in current Marvel, like, let's... All right, cool, cool, cool. Nice, nice, nice. We we running through. Y'all gave me a little bit. I'm. I will always question you on that Iron Man. Yeah, y'all know he ain't no Iron Man level. <laughs> Here we 
go. Ooh, I like the animation already, though. Yeah. That's got to feel of a... That looks pretty close, actually. Yeah. Yeah. He already, he already way too hype. How are you gonna say that after you just fell apart? I don't fall apart that easy. Picking up the pieces. <laughs> I like, I like the Japanese, the kanji made it up. That kanji put it over the top for me. It was such a simple thing, but it was just like... No, that's smart. Okay, so who's gonna win it out? Cause that's gonna be the winner. Practically decided. Yeah. He just phased through it. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh, he done that. I knew it. But Rodeo will survive it because he took on that new yep. before. Yeah. Yep. Kind of. Well, then again, I'm not current with Thomas, but at least when he was first using that, it like did damage to his body. 
mm-hmm. when he used it. Thank you for Eh, I, mean, I mean, like, again, all the stuff that they put out for Rhodey at that, 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 that was a dub. Oh, is that Gray? Oh, that's my that's my boy Gray? Who are you mm-hmm. fighting? Oh. Oh, oh, Lord. Gray and Ezda? Ooh. Hey. Hey, hold on a minute. Oh. Hold on a minute, right? Let me just... I'm excited for that one. Oh, man. I am, oh, ex- man. I am me, excited for this one. Let me express to y'all something real quick. Just, this is just real quick. Mm. Okay. Okay. Oh. Uh, this is gonna be interesting. Gray has got that. <laughs> for a fact. Demon Slayer Gray by the time. Ooh. No, I know about Demon Slayer. If it were, if it were, if it were right. normal. If it were normal gray, that would be that 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 would be like a little more even. But Demon Slayer gray, by the by the end of Fairy Tale, I I'm not even. Ooh ooh, as death ain't even. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 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 No. No. First of all, that's gonna be my that's my prediction on that one. Gray. For for today though, all right. For all y'all that was the repping this man, hey look. We gave him a shine in the beginning, okay? Gave him a shine. Still had the gems. We can admit when we were wrong. Mm-hmm. I admit it. Oh. I don't like that they didn't include the, like, the chameleon and the, like, phasing tech, like, harm does damage to Rhodey. I'd at least like to have seen it. I'll, I'll put it that way, even if it was, like, uh, you know, just, like, minuscule. Stuff like that. I also... Don't know if it allows him to like face through heat. Mm-hmm. Like if he's getting fire blasted at him, I, I don't know if it allows him to just like face through everything. Right. But I, I give it that. Like as soon as they got to the point of like Rhodey taking the nuke, um, because I ain't know he ain't got hit by a nuke <laughs> and survived and walked and walked away. I'll put it that way. I I'm, I know that he's been hit by very powerful things, but most of the time I see him get like knocked out or he like survives but can't fight no more or something like that. Um, right. At least in comics and stuff like that. I ain't, I ain't never seen him get hit by a nuke and then just still be ready to battle. Um, so that said, I give it to Rhodey, man. He he came through. Shoot, there ain't nothing much more to go off of that one. It was just. Surprise victory. Today, comic BS has taken <laughs> the place of anime shenanigans. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. What a crazy world we live in. <laughs> but next time, it's all anime shenanigans, apparently. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. I got a decision on the next death battle. This uh, death death. Gray. Um, well, I already know you on. Uh, you got Gray picking this one up. Oh yeah, no, no, no. Gray's my boy. Like I, I, I'd vote for him regardless, regardless. Like, this isn't. This is about, and this should go the same way that they did when they did uh Natsu and Ace from One Piece. Yep. To where I was just like, but it doesn't matter what Ace could do in One Piece because Natsu can eat fire and power himself. I'm pretty sure the Demon Slayers are like the same way of where they're immune to their element. Yeah. At least. So that's why I'm just like, I, if if Greg doesn't win this, then... Someone's <laughs> gotta give. I'm just saying, one of them made it to the end of their anime, even though Ezdeth's anime was like a, a bit... Oh. Uh, as this anime and manga is a bit more like, <laughs> that was intense. Mm-hmm. Like living in the uh, a comic I kill universe is fatal. Mm-hmm. You had best be lucky. <laughs> man, oh man. But yeah, guys, I think that was it. Glad you could join us on this reaction. It was us plus you, and we we did the thing, man. Yeah. I enjoyed the battle. Enjoyed the animation for it and everything. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. Mm-hmm. Shoot. 
I hope. I know that they're gonna go back to sprites for this one, but that was, that was cool to see the little 2D animation and whatnot. You know, you can't get enough of that these days. Yeah. <sighs> All right, nicely done. Mm-hmm. Any final words from you? No, not really. It was, it was a good matchup, a good death battle. Yeah. And, 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 and it was a fair one. And it was, it fair, was a fair and, one. And War Machine, he was his military background a little bit, just his calmness and stuff. You know, he just a little. little yeah, no. As soon as he went into that hot headed, hot headed like, like, mode, I was like, well, you know where this is going. But overall, I, I thought they were gonna give him his more like. Like that cold demeanor where he's just like not taking anything lower. He's really like analytical and stuff like that. But as soon as he ran in, I was like being hot headed like he was in season one of One Punch Man. I was just like, oh, well, <laughs> <laughs> shoot, you would get killed regardless. Yeah. Even if you were the stronger one in this situation, you would get killed regardless because it's like you can't just go up against like Someone a trained like, tactician with a military. varying amount of uh, like tools in the tool chest like that skill sets so yeah that's it guys uh we gonna get up on out of here megan do the thing don't forget to like comment subscribe share with your friends thanks megan all right y'all we gonna roll out i'm will knight i'm jt wolf be brave be bold be you and hopefully we will be in your future later <laughs>